Philly got really close to getting up to 100 yesterday afternoon, warmed up to 99 degrees. So yet another day of not seeing triple digit heat. Maybe you're not uh, you're happy about that because temperatures have been really hot across the northeast and that's still prompting that threat for severe weather. In addition to that cold front that's going to run into this really warm and juicy air across the Atlantic seaboard. So here's our severe weather alerts. We have a severe thunderstorm watch for the entire state of Maine and down through New Hampshire and then includes the entire state of Massachusetts, Connecticut, Rhode Island, Long Island included in these alerts until 8 p.m. this evening where we could see some damaging winds. We could also have some large or uh, rather some tornadic development across these areas. Hail is not going to be as big of a concern across these locations. I'm having some issues with my clicker so maybe Kit will click for me here as we're expecting some additional thunderstorm across areas from Washington DC and down through Virginia. This is going to take us until 10 p.m. and here comes that cold front that's making its way through the Atlantic seaboard. Now this extends all the way down through West Virginia and Kentucky where we're expecting some of those thunderstorms that may be a little bit slower before our coastal areas see that. So for your Monday severe weather potential, it's at a level two across our east coast and down through the state of Virginia and up through the Chesapeake Bay and then the marginal risk extends farther to our east. The wind potential is going to be the number one concern with today's thunderstorms where we could have winds exceed 60 miles per hour as we get through the rest of this afternoon and evening. There is that isolated tornado threat. We could potentially see some spin up ahead of the line, but once this becomes a bit more linear, brief in nature is what we're expecting across these eastern areas. We'll take you into the forecast here and talk a little bit more about the timing of today's thunderstorms. Here comes some of those discrete cells we've been detailing on Viper for you and through the nighttime hours, things should start to wrap up through the overnight.